that. Everyone loves the lead singer. All right, go. You should have more than one panel because it wasn't enough. I agree, right? Well, well, thanks to Ricky, apparently I do. What are you doing? A panel of a fourth. Oh, yeah. um, so, my question is about uh, Mark Shepard and Crowley. That is to you. So This won't be awkward. <laughs> that's, the, that's actually a very, very good situation to have. Um, how do you think it was to choose Mark Shepard to do Crowley? Do you think it's because of his humor? That's pretty much like he brought it to, to, to Crowley, of course. But do you think it's because it would match so much? What, what do you think? How do you think it was, he was choosing? <laughs> uh -huh. I'm sorry, yeah, I missed that last part. So, Mark Shepard and Crowley? Yes. How do you think it was the process to actually choose him to be Crowley? Because I think they are very much alike. Of course, he brought all this to Crowley, but what is the freedom for him to, to work with it? And how, how, was, how was it the process to choose him? Uh, well, Mark read and uh, knocked it out of the park. Uh, Crowley, in our mind, when that character was created as a crossroads demon, right? Um, we we never know. I mean, it was the same with Gabriel and, and, and Crowley. We don't know that they're going to do more than one or two episodes. Uh, when we get actors like this, um, uh, Jim Beaver, that was one episode. Um, you know, we. I guess we know gold when we see it. We go, well, we gotta, you know, use these people more. Uh, Mark's part is uh, evolved into something, you know, really, uh, really quite big and, uh, and special. And, and he kills it. You know, the writers love to write for Mark, um, and he. Uh, Eugenie uh, has his voice down, just, you know, fantastic, uh, you know, and we always, you know, for Eugenie to go, um, yeah, that's a good idea for a script, but you gotta write Crowley, because she writes Crowley great, and uh, Mark, he just kills it, and it's, you know, it's just evolved. Uh, Gabriel was, was a one-off. We love Richard, back he came. Um, so, you know, when we cast these parts, we don't really know if these characters are going to stick uh, or if they're going to be one. Charlie was one episode. We loved her, brought her back, brought her back, brought her back. She became a... Um... <laughs> easy now, easy now. <laughs> they're not over it yet, Bob. They're really fresh today. That she's going to come back, so it's yeah. fine. Yes, she'll, uh, you know. She's very busy, Felicia, you know. Did, actually, getting her... Getting her in the last uh, episode she did this season, Felicia was really busy, so we shot episode 21 uh, last to accommodate Felicia's schedule and had a very short post-production time to actually get that, that episode on the air in, in order. Um, you know, we loved Felicia and, and thought it was absolutely worth it to bend over backwards to make that work. So, um, you know, it's not like Felicia's sitting home and going, oh, I hope Supernatural's going to call again. She's, she's a really busy... Uh, she's doing busy fine. Yeah. yeah, she's doing fine. Um, so, you know, if you miss Felicia, she's on, online every day, right? Yeah. <laughs> we know, because she's in the green room online right now. Right. Thank you for the question. Thank you. You. Oh, yeah, so I got a question for Bob. We know that. This is a I just no. listen, man. Listen, this is our idea. The people Bob. have not had enough Bob. I'm bringing Bob to the people. I give the people what they want. It's not what we've been signing all about. I'm a people person, Bob. I mean, I wanted to ask more like what Doctor Who. If he was a doctor in Doctor Who, what he would he wear? But that would that would be it. That and that's Bob. hypothetical. So let's get a real question. Let's get a real question. But Bob, we know that Jimmy Novak has gone and passed after the meat soup died. What about Adam? He's definitely not killed. <laughs> because we did see him get blown up by a Molotov and jelly cocktail, and therefore his soul must be in heaven. Can you confirm that, please? <laughs> you're saying Adam's soul is definitely in heaven? Heaven? That, yeah. Definitely. In, and you're asking Bob to confirm that Adam is not in hell and he's definitely yes. in heaven? because somehow you worked out that his soul is in heaven. 
Well, most of us kind of think Most of you think that? Yeah. Um, or like, just put our minds at ease. Um, <laughs> I don't think so. Adam was, uh, you guys are going to correct me on this, and you're going to go, don't bring him back, he doesn't know what he's talking about. Uh, Adam was the, uh, was a, uh, a brother the boys never knew. Yeah, the half-brother. Yes. Um, I believe in the mythology for whatever was going to happen in that thing, what, the brothers had to fight each other, and I believe that he and Lucifer are in the cage together in hell. That's, that's my memory of it. And that's that's the premise we've been going on for the last four or five years. So that that's what we think. Sorry, yes. bummer. <laughs> and by the way, by the way, you know, we we, we know that's a hanging chat, and, and and we talk about that in the writers' room. You know, are, are we ever going to break him out of the cage? You know, and if you break him out of the cage, what does that do to Lucifer? And if Lucifer's Lucifer's out of the cage, does he come after Crowley? I mean. All these things are talked about in the writers' room, and you know, and they may come to fruition at some point. Well, I, I would love to see Pellegrino and Shepard going at it. Would be awesome. That's, that's a hell of a lot to pack into next week's episode. You, you where I die by hamster, and let's go off and do a penguin movie. Yeah, uh, question is obviously for Bob. Um, it's been going on that. It's been, uh, this is the last question. Um, it's, uh, it's been said that uh, there's this theory that Chuck is God. But um, I remember Castiel uh, grabbing the amulet and saying, I'm going to go find God, and if I find God, the amulet is going to tell me that um, he is God, yeah, that I found God. But when uh, Dean is, uh, is with Chuck, the amulet does nothing. So is Chuck God, and why did he vanish and suddenly show up for the 200th episode? What happened? <laughs> It's a, it's a nine-parter, Bob. <laughs> it's the first part. You know, Richard and I have known each other for a long, long time. We did a pilot back in 2002 two or yeah. something. And I love Richard, and it was great to have Richard come and uh, do Gabriel for us. But you're never going to work with me again. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. Um, <laughs> What we always thought was, and, and I think that was the last episode of season five, if I'm not correct. That, that's when Eric Kripke said, here guys, run with the ball, and he gave us uh, a ball and a thousand yards to run with it. Um, we talk about this a lot. Is Chuck God? Is Chuck not God? Um, the uh, Samuel I really wouldn't have a whole lot of, um, uh, I mean, you know, God's God. So, you know, just because uh, Dean is wearing that, it's not going to have a, a huge effect on, on that. I don't know if you guys uh, saw the 200th episode where uh, Chuck came back. Yeah. yeah. Um, we, we toy around with this, this idea a lot, and uh, well, we, for next season we haven't really solidified a, a whole lot of what we're going to do, but we know that... Um, we're playing with uh, the darkness and the light, and good and evil, and, and a lot of God stuff we're talking about. I, I always think actually portraying God or having God as a character is kind of a tricky bit of business. Uh, having said that, we love Rob. Uh, so we're, we're talking about it, but it's, you know, it's not as easy as a demon or, a, or, or just an ordinary angel. <laughs> Um, but listen, you know, we, we, we had the devil, but you know, we've seen that a lot. God, you don't see that much on a regular basis, so this one's hard for us, but um, I get where you're coming from, and we're talking about it. It's, it's a wait and see on God on that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, 